Hello, I'm Eleanor. Hello, Eleanor. I've arranged a brief tour to collect the shoes you ordered for Charlie's birthday. You hadn't forgotten, had you? I'm ready when you are. Hello, I'm Eleanor. Hello, Eleanor. I've arranged a brief tour to collect the shoes you ordered for Charlie's birthday. You hadn't forgotten, had you? I'm ready when you are. We will be arriving in a few minutes. You do have an early start in the morning. Enjoy yourself. I'll be here waiting for you. Here we are with the Rolls-Royce Vision Next 100. It's a very unique vehicle, made for a very unique person, somewhere in the future, let's say 20 years from now, where we believe our customers will come to Rolls-Royce expecting a fully bespoke service. Let's say that this car actually offers for the first time in the history of Rolls-Royce a fully unique coach-built service matched with a unique interior on a fully electric drivetrain, fully autonomous, for two people, travelling in great tranquility, in effortless motion, just like our customers do today.
it was very important right at the beginning of the creative process that the exterior design team captured the magical DNA of Rolls-Royce. For example, the long front bonnet stretching out into the night, guided by the uplit spirit of ecstasy through Manhattan, Mayfair, Beijing, all these glamorous places that are high net worth individuals travel. This lovely sweeping silhouette, almost like Wraith with its fastback profile that stretches right to the rear of the car, captures the glamour, the essence of bespoke in the future, which we felt was very important for this unique individual. Perhaps the most important aspect of the exterior was to evoke this sense of efficiency, the sense of lightweight electric architecture. The vehicle is fully autonomous, it has an electric motor at the front, electric motor at the rear, and we wanted to evoke these values very much in the lightweight nature of the uh, lines and the body structure. So in this view here, you have lines that bounce up, so to speak, from the side of the vehicle and converge very gracefully into this box tail. There's a lot of nautical uh, familiarity with the way that we've treated the rear of the car. This beautiful diffuser type surface that comes up from the rear, again, suggesting efficiency. Perhaps more importantly though, was the reference to the 10EX. This was a, an experimental vehicle developed by Sir Henry Royce in the 1920s. One of the most beautiful pieces of bodywork that we can think of by Barker at the time. And the design team wanted to pen homage to this lovely sense of discipline and order, the punctuation of the rear lights, the fine honed lines, all reference that vehicle. So here you can see how the design team set out to stage that moment of grand arrival. The sanctuary, that peaceful haven, suddenly opens up into the night with this grand majestic gesture, the side opening door which allows the occupants to stand up and either enter gracefully or more importantly arrive gracefully with this lovely red light carpet shining away into the night. And so too, our spirit of ecstasy, or should I say, Eleanor Thornton. She was a lady who existed in 1911. She was actually sculpted by a famous sculptor by the name of Charles Sykes. And since then, she's adorned the radiators of every Rolls Royce. But importantly, here with the Rolls Royce Vision Next 100 vehicle, we bring her to life. We hear the voice of Eleanor for the very first time. She is the artificial intelligence for this vehicle. More importantly, your ethereal concierge, your virtual assistant, there to attend to your every wish.